Downloading TikTok videos gives you the option to share the video to other preferred platforms. It also gives you the option to be creative with the short video clips. Either way, you have to download the TikTok video file first. In this video, I'm going to walk you through on how to download TikTok videos on your desktop device. Hi there, I'm Winston the Solopreneur Warrior and in this video, I'm going to show you how to download a TikTok video directly on your PC device. But before we get into all that, if this is your first time to this channel and you're interested in making side income online as an affiliate marketer, make sure to hit that subscribe button and let's get started. Now, recently, I was looking for ways to download video clips from TikTok to use in one of my channel videos, kind of a compilation of tips on the best time to post on TikTok, and here is what I did. For me, I have this TikTok Chrome extension installed on my computer. Since TikTok is a mobile app device, the TikTok Chrome extension will help you easily access TikTok on your desktop. I'll be dropping the link to this extension below this video. Now, after downloading and installing the extension on your computer, you want to look on your browser toolbar here on the top and you will see the TikTok icon. Click on it. When you do that, the TikTok app will open up on your computer. Mind you, this extension works almost like the real mobile app device with only a few options absent, like the future for creating videos directly using just the app. As you well know, with the real TikTok app, you can click on the plus button and record your video, but that's not possible with this Chrome TikTok extension. Now, if you want to download a TikTok video for whatever reason, the first thing you need to do is search for the video you want to download and then click on the share option here and copy the video link. Now, if you know how to download videos on any of these other platforms, you can simply share the video on the platform, then go to the platform and download the video. Personally, since I know how to download Twitter videos, I could use Twitter to download this video by first posting it on my Twitter account and then going to my Twitter account and download it from there. But since that's not the topic of this video, I will leave it right there. Now, after copying your TikTok video link, head over to this site called TT Downloader. Now, you want to paste your TikTok video link in this box here and hit the Get Video Red button. The TT Downloader will now go to work and prepare your video for easy download. Now, when that is over, the TT Downloader tool will give you these different options of the same video to be downloaded. So, that's how easy it is to download a TikTok video on your PC. Now, as a YouTube creator or any content creator for that matter, it's about time to start looking at TikTok not only as a platform for kids anymore. It's also a platform to easily generate free traffic to whatever content you have posted online, which is why I also recently started a TikTok account to promote my channel videos for more views. It's because of the interest that I have now for TikTok that I came across this cool tool called Video Tick, and I thought it's worth sharing it with you if you also create content on TikTok. Basically, Video Tick is a cloud-based software that will help you turn your YouTube videos into a TikTok video size and also help you schedule the video posts to be posted at the best time, which is of course when your most viewers are online. Now just check out how you can start using the Video Tick software to grow your TikTok account. All right, so in this video, I'm going to show you how you can quickly create a TikTok video or viral TikTok video that you can post on your TikTok account to generate more traffic to your offers, to your products, or just to your profile to get more subscribers on TikTok, on YouTube or Instagram, okay? And you don't have to be on a camera to create these funny, engaging videos for TikTok. Now, we all know TikTok is all about funny videos, engaging videos, educational videos, and you don't necessarily have to be on a camera to create those kind of videos. So with VideoTik, you can create three different kind of videos, the code videos, GIF videos, and viral videos. These are the three general type of videos that are very popular on TikTok and get the most engagement. So let me show you each one of them and how you can quickly create. So let's start with funny GIF videos. So if I click on this tab right here, I can give my campaign a title. Now it's gonna ask me for a keyword. So 
whatever I want to create the video about, let's say I want to create a video about workout. So I'm going to type workout. How many slides do I want? Of course, I can add more later, but this is for the beginning. So let's say I want three slides. So video tech went out there, picked three funny trending GIF about workout and put them all there. Now, if I, if I don't like something, I can always change it. I can click on this refresh icon. It's going to load a new GIF, right? I can add more slides. If I click on this, it's going to add another um, you know, funny GIF about workout. I can change how long a specific slide is going to be on the screen. I can add text position. I can add more text, right? I can change the position. I can put it anywhere. I can change font, customize it exactly the way I want. I can add font color. I can add a background to the font. I can add a blurness on the background. So, you know, the background gets blurred for this slide specifically. And, you know, the text is more visible if I want to use the slide as an outro slide, as a closing slide. I can increase the font size if I want to make things more visible if it's the ending slide or whatever. And I can keep on editing all these slides as I want. I, can, I have full control over how I want to customize this. Now, once I've done that, I'm going to click on next. And this is where I can add my own logo, my own watermark. Click on next and add background music, text to speech voiceover, uh, or you can, you know, uh, upload your own voiceover if you have already recorded it. Now you get access to tons of uh, background music that we have already added, or you can choose to, you know, type in your text to speech for each slide. You know, you, you can have a separate message for this slide and a separate you know, audio for this slide. And you can pick from tons of different languages. You can pick from tons of different accents for each language and you can save them. Once you're done, all you have to do is click on next, pick if you want 720p or 1080, make sure it's always MP4 and you click on start creating video. Now it's going to take another minute or two for a video take to create your video, but this is how you create a video. So it could be a GIF video. Now it could also be a code video. Let me show you how you can create a motivational code video. So you click on code video tab over here and video tech will all automatically pick a slide. It's going to create your first slide for you. It's going to add a, you know, a deep meaning background picture and a code on it. And you know, if you click on plus sign, you can add more slides and old slides have a code and a background, interesting background, a motivational background added by default. Now, what you can do is you can again, customize all of them the way you want. Now, if I go to uh, slide setting, I can of course control how long the slide's going to be. I can click on slide code and I can pick, uh, you know, from over 5,000 codes, or I can add my own if I want to. Now, if I go here, I can reposition it. I can change this code and write my own code. Um, I can add a different font, make it look better, increase the font size. Again, same customization, just the way we did in GIF videos. Everything is pretty much the same. If I want to add a different image, I can add a different image. I can add a different video. You know, you can search from different videos and you can add those videos here. Uh, it's going to play that video in the background and you'll have your code. So again, you have full control over how you want your video to be. So this is how you can create a code video. The final kind of video is trending video. So what it's going to do, we're going to click on viral video tab. We're going to give it a name and again, workout and three slides. So what it's going to do, it's going to go to YouTube and different video hosting, video sharing websites and find three trending videos about workout, put them all over here. And what you can do is you can trim them. I can take a part of this video, this small clip, and I can curate all these videos together, put them all together. And then again, I can add my text, customize the way I want. So once you've done creating your video, which you can see on the dashboard, if you go back, once you're done creating your video, so as you can see, this video has rendered successfully. I can edit it again. I can delete it. I can download the video. I can share the video on Scivid application, on library application and script real application or I could post this video as it is on YouTube and Facebook right from the dashboard. Now, the thing here is this video is still a regular rectangular video, a horizontal video. What we want is a vertical video for TikTok. So step two is once you've created your video, you're gonna go, we're gonna go to Trim Reel over here. Now Trim Reel helps us to convert our regular video into TikTok friendly video. Now you can pick from the videos you have created by clicking on this little button over here, all the videos that you have created, you can pick from them. For example, let me pick this video that I created. 
Okay, so I've got this video over here. Now, what I want to do is I want to convert this into 9 is to 16. So I'm going to click on 9 is to 16. And it's going to convert the video into 9 is to 16. Now, you have multiple options. If you want to create a square video, you can do that as well. Um, if you want to create a 4 is to 3 video, you can do that. 5 is to 4, 16. 9 is to 16 is the version that you want for TikTok. Now, again, Trim Reel, this feature in Video Tick is very powerful there's so much you can do with it but again we're going to focus on tiktok here so i'm going to pick 9 is 16. now i'm going to click on this video as you can see there's a little black bar so i'm just going to move it around so it looks perfect perfect ideally this is all i have to do and click on create that's all i want to do but if you want to be creative if you want to do more you can go into video tab over here you can add a no crop so you know the video is still vertical but you know, everything is visible. And then you can add, you can go here and add some text. You can change the font of the text. You know, you can add a top and bottom bar. You can make them bold or underline. You can add emojis if you want. You're good to go. You click on create. It's gonna take a couple of seconds, couple of minutes, and then the video will be available right here. Next step, once we're done creating the video. So we created a video using GIF, video or code video or viral video and we've converted that video into TikTok friendly video. Next step is to schedule this video. So I'm going to click on scheduler over here. The way scheduler works is products and companies like TikTok and Instagram, they do not like automation. They do not like you scheduling 500 years worth of, you know, content and it auto posts on their platform. This is not how they uh, want their networks, their companies, their apps to be. So we have to work in a white hat way. The white hat way is you schedule a video uh, using the web app and then you have to install a mobile app on your Android for phone or an iOS phone, your iPhone. And what's going to happen is once the time arrives when that video is scheduled for, you're going to get a push notification, get a quick notification on your phone. You tap on that and your video will be published. So let me show you how that works. Okay. So again, on scheduler, you can pick from all the videos you have created, or you can upload your own videos. You can see how many posts have been, how many videos have been published, how many videos are still scheduled. And you can see all of them here. You can modify them, delete them, whatever you want. Now, Let's say I want to schedule a video to be published on the on the Sunday, on the 24th. So I'm going to click on add post button here and I'm going to pick the video that I've created using video take. Now it's going to be the same video that I've just modified uh, using trim reel. What's going to happen is it's going to ask me for a campaign name. Since we have added this, I'm going to click on next. I'm going to click what time I want this video to be published. I want it at three. Uh, at 3 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Here we go. And I'm going to click on Schedule. That's it. So what's going to happen is on the Sunday at 3 p.m., I'm going to get a quick notification on my phone. And since I'm always on my phone, all I have to do is tap on that notification and the video will be published on TikTok. So just to show you an example, I've installed the TikTok publisher app uh, on my Android phone, which you can, of course, download from the dashboard of uh, Video Tick. All right, as you can see, I just got this notification that it says it's time to post video on TikTok. So I'm gonna tap on this. It's gonna open up the TikTok app and all I have to do is click on next. Click on next. If I wanna, again, customize that more music and stuff, I can do that and just click on post. My caption is already copied into my clipboard. So all I have to do is paste, click on post and my video will be published on TikTok. It's that easy, guys. You can schedule one or two video to go live every day and you can grow your TikTok account, start selling, start getting more followers and start getting more views, start leveraging this brand new platform out there. And with all that, I'll wrap up this video. I hope it was helpful. If so, hit the like button below, share on your preferred social site and don't forget to hit that subscribe button so you don't miss another helpful video. Mm -hmm.